Downtown Temple on a Tuesday night. Beautiful evening for skies remain clear. I do think we're going to see clouds on the increase as we get later into the evening hours because the front's getting closer to us. I think clouds are going to develop along that. It's been a warm afternoon for us. We hit 78 degrees at the airport, 77 in Mahia today. Our thanks to April Perolini for her report. And Hugh and Kurt Krakowian saw 77 degrees. And Salado, Tom Breeden saw the mercury get up to 78 degrees. So it's a very warm late November temperatures around the area. If you connect the dots, basically this cloud cover here is where the frontal boundary lays and it stretches from near Oklahoma City on back towards uh, Sherman Dennis in that area just to the north of Dallas, but cuts into Fort Worth. They're already seeing a light north wind in Fort Worth to Stephenville on out towards Comanche and, and Meridian that area out to the northwest of us. It's con continuing to slowly push its way towards us. It doesn't have a whole lot of punch. We'll get a wind shift, but that's about all there is to it. It'll wash out as it gets over into deep east Texas and along the Gulf Coast. Behind it, though, tomorrow night, we have another frontal boundary, which is a little bit stronger, a little more cool air. So we're gradually start knocking these temperatures on down a little bit. By morning, 51 degrees under a fair sky. Well, cloudy late tonight, but we'll clear out by mid morning or so. It'll be a cooler day. Remember, we had 78 this afternoon. 71 will be the high temperature tomorrow with winds out of the northwest around five miles an hour. This is our future track computer model. This frontal system just kind of slides in here, sneaks in real quietly. All we get is a very light little wind shift. It's not even going to be very strong, gusty north winds. We're talking about five to 15 miles an hour at best. And by tomorrow afternoon, we should be looking at readings back up into the mid to upper 60s, maybe the low 70s. I I think 63 right now with a dew point of 53 and 70% relative humidity. Still clocking wind out of the south at around 10 miles an hour. Here's your Channel 6 seven day forecast where your weekend's always in view. Again, let me let me reiterate here. We have front boundary making its way in late tonight. We get a second front coming in late Wednesday night, early Thursday morning. Keeps those winds out of the north. Keeps the atmosphere fairly dry for us. Uh, mornings will be nice. The afternoons will be mild with readings in the 70 to 72 degree range. Tomorrow will be around 70 to 69 on Thursday and Friday. Slightly milder temperatures as we get into the weekend. More moisture is coming back as those winds go back around to the south and to the southeast. That could set up our first shot at some rain in eight to 10 days, depending on who you talk to. Uh, we have not really had good measurable rain in almost two weeks in a few spots. Not anticipating a lot of rain on Tuesday, but a few showers nonetheless. Uh, the lights uh, in nature are on display now at Blora. We will be uh, out every day for the foreseeable future collecting toys mm -hmm. for Camo Santa. Mm -hmm. And I will be out ringing the bell for the Salvation Army again next Tuesday in Temple at uh, the Walgreens. So busy holiday season. Yep. It's starting. Yes. All right, Andy, <laughs> thank you.